If time is now, how does the concept of ancestors actually exist? So there is no concept of time on the other side. We are in linear contract right now. When we come into this contract, we make an agreement to be in linear time. But time is non-linear, meaning all of your past lives and your current life and even your future lives are all existing at the same time. And remember that the idea of spirit intelligence moves also through dimensional spectrums, which we have a hard time contemplating that. Well, I have my blood line me and my father and my grandfather that's an ancestral line it goes in a tear but because spirit doesn't move in a tear spirit moves in all these different spectrums of dimensional intelligence it could be grandparent energy which is also simultaneously connection connected to you in another realm of energy through maybe partnerships or different kind of karmic ties all of those things are moving and oscillating at all times and in all frequencies so even though this experience right now is chemo and my father and my grandfather are in a linear line it is not like that on the other side it is this amorphous shape that is always going on. Let me give you a visual if you are a visual learner. Look at this necklace that I'm wearing. So this is Pikake. I don't know if you are, if you are Polynesian, you know this. And we have Iliahi. Now, these are singular experiences. This is Chinese jasmine and Iliahi, sandalwood. So as I'm looking at this, I'm looking at them specifically in a line. But now zoom out. Look at how this Pikake Iliahi is making a lei around my neck. It's moving in a circle. Where's the beginning and where's the end? There's no clamp. There's no beginning and there's no end. It's just moving in rotation. That's how ancestry works. Spiritual ancestry on the other side. We have our DNA ancestry, but then we have our spiritual soul ancestry. And ancestry. Andestry. <laughs> Does that help? I hope that helps.